You! Give up! We caught you red-handed! Darn! That voice! It's a Hellion! Purify him. Yeah. You need something, oh great shepherd? Is it alright if I deal with this boy? I'm afraid not. The only way to apprehend pickpockets is to catch them in the act. But... but he's... If you do the crime, you do the time. No matter how old you are. This kid just wasn't ready for real-world consequences. <clears throat> hey, mister! Why don't you let Saray have a talk with him before you take him away? Just a word from the shepherd might steer the kid toward the right path in life, better than any time in detention. That would be pointless. Come on, it won't do any harm. What, you got some problem with Saray talking to this boy? I never said that. It would simply be a waste of time. You said this kid wasn't prepared to deal with the real-world consequences of his crimes. Are you prepared, mister? What? I'm part of a merchant crew that travels all over the world. You think I don't know why the pickpocketing problem is so bad? <laughs> I see. How much do you want? Don't put me on your level. We Sparrow Feathers value our customers' trust. Saray, we're taking this guy to jail, too. L like hell you are, you lying brat! You will not lay a finger on her. Shepard! Oh, hey! Stop! Wait! Saray! Go after him. Okay! If it ain't one thing. Saray, I'll go after them as well. Please purify that boy. Shepard or not, I won't let you obstruct my duties! <sighs> Guard, leave him alone! Even we can tell something about you stinks! Yeah, what kind of guard are you? You think we don't know what you're up to when our backs are turned? You dirty crook! I think we're good here. Let's go after Rose. Yeah, you're right. Phew! You made it. Is it over? Maybe. If it really bugs you that much, why don't you check up on it? Well, how would we do that? Let him lead us home. Oh, so he wanders and we tail him. That could work. All right then. Saray, Rose, you guys hide. I'll go wake him up. Looks like they've made their decision. Are you okay with this, Lila? Well, as long as we only follow him. Think he'll stop pickpocketing now? We purified him after all. Mm, not so sure about that. I've heard word of pickpocket gangs. Oh, really? We need to find out whether he was doing it on his own or with a group. you knew why the pickpocketing problem is so bad. The enforcers let him off a lot of the time in exchange for part of the takings. Then, when the guards need to hit their quotas, they round them up anyway. That's probably what that was about. No way.
Look, he's going in. A noble's manor? It's clearly not his house. I'm guessing a pickpocket gang, then. And so this must be their base. Something tells me he's not gonna quit stealing. Well, crap. Come on, we're not done yet. Rose, it's unfortunate, but I'm not sure we should... Lila means that this is just a problem of human society. Right. It might not be something a shepherd should get involved in. Huh. Sorry. If he's doing it by himself, I'd be okay letting him deal with the consequences. But if there's a gang forcing him to steal, it's a completely different story. I gotta check to make sure. Yeah, I thought... I understand. Let's go check it out just in case. You sure? But no more than that. Understood? Saray, Rose, even if you don't intend them to, the powers of the Shepherd and the Squire can greatly influence human society and the spirits of men. Please don't forget that. All right. We'll just watch and see who goes in and out. Bored. Who knew that we wouldn't see anything for days on end? You all can go back to the inn. I'm staying here. It's okay. Shh. Someone's coming out. It's a bunch of little kids. Those kids? You think maybe they're not being forced to pickpocket? <sighs> We've come this far. Let's see this thing through. Dezel? You go follow those brats. I'll go check out the building. Thanks. Oh boy. Don't go for anything big, got it? Only money and jewelry and stuff. Are they gonna have anything like that? That shepherd guy did something, and now there's lots more people donating stuff to the sanctuary. Oh cool, that sounds fun. Priests won't be mean to kids, and if there's any real problems, we can always start crying. <laughs> I'm good at that. Hey, is this really okay? It's okay if you're us and not them. Is this what kids are like these days? Dangerous times. <sighs> Those kids barely have any malevolence at all. Children and their brutal honesty can be even crueler than corrupted adults. As you've seen. <sighs> Dezel, how was it? The building was completely empty. Those scamps are probably just camping out there. So then, those kids are acting on their own. All right, it's snatching time. <sighs> Now that we know the score, do we want to report them to the guards and end this whole thing? After all, they're not Hellions. <sighs> Let's tell the guards about it, and then put it all behind us. Okay. I can't do that! Hey, Rose! Darn it! What do you want? Look, I never did nothing! We know all about what you're up to. Fooling the priests into thinking you're helpless orphans, and then robbing them blind. You should be ashamed of yourselves! Oh yeah? You got any proof? This here is the shepherd. His word is good enough. Th that's perjury! False witness! Princess Alicia and the people of Lady Lake all trust Saray. Because he's been living an honest life. How about you? Will anyone trust your word? Oh. <sighs> Give it up, kid. What else can we do? The adults all abandoned us. If we want to survive, stealing's our only choice. Rose, maybe we ought to... Come on, Saray. Let's bring ours.
But to think children their age could conceive of such wretched duplicity. And the other children? They were all caught by the guards and hauled away. I see. Those who commit crimes must be punished, even if they are children. It's the way the world works. But it still pains the heart. Yeah. Hmm.